Y'all, so this situation with Blueface and Krishan is getting scarier as the details come in. So Krishan just went live to discuss what happened with Blueface taking the baby at 4 a.m. with no clothes on. So she basically said she was at the studio and her sister and her best friend Marsh was watching Krishan Jr., which I don't see anything wrong with that. But what's crazy is the fact that Blueface is trying so hard to paint her out to be such a bad mom, but yet he's dragging his kids to video shoots and shit like that so but anyways the whole live she didn't show her face because she said you know her eye was black and you know she had black and blues all over her arm then you see Jaden in the car with her and Marsh and honestly I feel like he put hands on her and possibly Jaden helped her out in this situation I don't know like I said the details are like slowly rolling out this is a crazy situation and I honestly feel so bad for the baby and Krishan I'll be updating y'all on whatever information I get, so make sure y'all subscribe, and I'm gonna check y'all later. Video and work, like, he like, I'm at the studio with the nigga, without your son, to respect you. Uh, yeah. Next time I'm bringing my kid, you know why? Because no nigga's gonna steal my kid at 4 a.m. in the morning. That's D-E-A dead. The f Are you f***ing S-T-U-P-I-A-D? Stupid? What? I woke up soon as I had that nigga in the womb, nigga. What the fuck? I've been moving different since that nigga came in the womb, nigga. That nigga, yeah, it's real. So, we get, okay, so we didn't pass the gate. He finally come to his senses. He get in my car. I leave my bitches out for the cops to come fuck with. I don't know. The cops was on their way. Real shit. Because when, when I pulled off with him and the baby. The cops passed us going the opposite direction. I'm like, damn, we just missed a whole charge. Because what the fuck? That's domestic. That's. Oh, hey, heaven. I love you. Come here. So, this is one of my nieces that stay at the house. I love you. So, um, you ready? Oh, hi, Adrian. This is Adrian. This is my nieces and nephews. This is why it was a blow up mattress at my house because um, I got 56 nieces and nephews. I'm the 11th out of 12 siblings. I'm opening up a restaurant. I put my sister in full faith in that shit. So we try to make some shit. Long story short. Well, I'm going through what I'm going through, bro. All right. So, bro, so, so we didn't get past the gate. We pull up. I said, call your baby mother. What? Check and see if she cool. I don't know if the cops went to her house to fuck with her and her kids. I don't know. You did some weird shit. We doing weird shit. We just because we we trying to co-parent, but you co-parent with a pain. You co-parent with spitefulness. You co-parent incorrectly. So what we could do to do as an adult to move from the situation? What? Call that. Bitch. I don't care for. That. I don't want you, my nigga. I'm with my nigga Suave. I'm not really on you like that right now like i'm really trying to branch off and be a new me so he not letting me be a new me he kind of like triggered me kidnapped my baby 3 a.m at 4 a.m in the morning from his bed my best friend called like you know what i'm saying i'm just thrown off bro and not like that i pay my best friends my nigga we make money daily nigga you babysit my baby it's a thousand dollars an hour nigga why because nigga that's how precious he is so when Marsh was supposed to jeopardize her freedom, her life. What she do? She did that for me, bro. And I got to my son in time that I needed. But I'm so sorry because it's like, God damn. I would never want to put my people or my family or friends or any type of harm's way. But God damn. He like, so long story short, we get in the car. I'm agreeing with everything. Let's be a whole big happy family. Whoop dee whoop dee whoop. Like, what? Well, I need a babysitter. If you really care about how he was left with my family and friends, that's so cute. I mean, you really care. So let's get to the root of the problem. You want it to be your way. Okay, what's your way? You know, I babysit my kid. I don't know that Jaden. Hopefully she got a good heart. I don't want my bitch pinched or burnt by a cigarette. Like, you know what I'm saying? I don't know. I watch scary movies. I don't know niggas. I don't know nothing. I don't know what's going on. So just help me find out what's going on so we're trying to dissect the situation i'm just letting the nigga know like all right so we finna woo we finna yeah like what's going on 
you're not finna f it, right? I'm like, no, nah, I'm finna give the b a hug because I don't know what's going on. Huh? He just abducted my kid. Oh, which let me know is this b do what you say because you can abduct our kids any time of day, too. So, like, she playing her cards right only because she have to. The fuck? Is nobody the issue? It's the common denominator, the nigga. So, long story short, we not with it. I'm finna get off live because I really have to have some shit with my baby daddy and his bitch and my kid. How can I provide for my kid if I don't have a babysitter or my friends or my family is locked in with my son? I don't have my BD. I don't trust the BD in his situation. And the bitch. So, I just missed out on my. I was finna perform at Rod Wave show today in San Diego. My hair not done. My lip is. I got a black eye. I got pieces on my arm. My oh, baby. Gas station, come on. Alright. <laughs> come on, come on, come on. Get in the car. Marsh, get in the car. The no, for real. <laughs> Marsh, get in this motherfucker. <laughs> oh. Bye, uh.